Hello everyone, my name is Ben Pope and welcome to episode 2 of Telltale Game of Thrones. It's lovely. Episode 1 was amazing. And we're going to start episode 2 with Jon Snow in the foreground picture here. Here we go. It might show us what happened, yeah, previously. So excited! These are dark days, I fear. <laughs> the North Grove must never be lost. You're sending him to the wall? The boy's done nothing wrong! The future of this house is in Lord Ethan's hands now. Duncan, I've decided to name you as my sentinel. I'm just worried about my family. The king was not inclined to offer help for your family. Are you willing to risk an alliance with the crown? I'm sorry, Lord Tyrion, but it's a risk I cannot afford. Your mother asked me to cross the narrow sea to find your brother, Rasha. We don't want White Hill men within these walls. You can be my highborn ward. Ethan. Yep, that happened. No! Ramsey's the best. Don't let them take me! <laughs> alright. Well, <laughs> it's not alright, but here we go. <laughs> Get the meat. Older brother. <laughs> Asher. <laughs> Whoa, it, it's just me, Beska. <sighs> Took you long enough. The rail's getting warm. Or warmer, I should say. We get to walk around. You can stop pacing. They'll be here soon. Let's look at the spill. Is that wine? Or blood? Taste it and find out. Nah. What else is here? Hooker. Fragrant. Only a forester brings his axe all the way to Essos. Wicked little thing, though. Yeah, we're gonna grab that. Look at this damage. Looks like we weren't the first to rough up the place. Okay, what are we supposed to do here? We looked at everything. Let's just uh, talk to her. Ale. It goes in yellow, comes out yellow. Waste time even drinking it, if you ask me. Considering we found it in an abandoned tavern, it's not bad. They smell off to you. It's the only thing in Yunkai that doesn't. I know. It's a filthy haven for thieves, murderers, and other deadly bastards. Yunkai, huh? You should feel right at home. Oh. I know I do. May we drink, thieve, and fight until the end. You know, I'm not really a bastard. But you're my kind of bastard. It's half the reason we're friends. <laughs> Another round? Someone's gonna bust through that door. Have you forgotten about our honored and exalted guest? Go oh. see if he's still breathing. Someone down there? Oh, jeez. How's he doing? 
We need him alive to collect his bounty. After that... Remind me again, what's this fat pig fucker's name? Bazak Zog... Something or other. Don't care, really. So long as we get our gold. Eight hundred gold dragons for capturing him. Lucky we caught him trying to flee Yunkai. Lucky for us. Not so lucky for him. We should find more former slave masters with bounties on their heads. I don't need any more naked fat men in my life, thank you. Oh. <laughs> they say only the poor know how to really spend money. We'll buy the finest wines, the best whores. Sleep in a bed without fleas? Sounds nice, doesn't it? We've not been paid yet, Beska. Can't spend dragons you don't have. We'll have them soon enough. My point is, with enough coin we could do anything. Go anywhere. I could afford passage back to Westeros. To Ironroth. I've heard nothing from my family in years. You mean go home? They treated you like shit there. Kicked you out because you fell in love with a girl from the wrong damn house. Gwyn. A man doesn't choose who he loves. Your family should understand that. Westeros and its bloody houses. Who fucking cares? They're still my family. My brothers and sisters. They had nothing to do with it. I suppose that's true. Just remember, we have a good thing here. Mm -hmm. And any moment now, we're gonna be rich. Except for... Let's make a toast. Wait, nothing's To all of yet. us deadly bastards. To us. Aye, to us. Oh, jeez. You're not that drunk, are you? Sorry. <laughs> Fine, have it your way. <laughs> I pressed W. Veske, I thought freed slaves put the bounty on Bazak. They did. With his own gold. So why are the fucking Lost Legion here? Oh, is that Tazal? From the Volantis job? Maybe he's forgotten about that. You! I told you if I saw you again! Tazal! Isn't it funny how life brings old friends together? I'd cut your fucking throats! It's good to see you too, Tazal. Where is he? Where's who? Here. Four hundred dragons. They must be working for the Wise Masters. And that's all you're getting. The bounty is eight hundred. You get four. It's more than you deserve. Mm-hmm. Give us eight hundred and you can have him. Don't be an asshole now. We're all sell swords here. We are nothing like you. The Lost Legion are the blood of all Valyria. And we are done taking orders from whimpering pigs. Bloody hell! Whoops. And we're done with you, too. Calm down, Tizal. We can still work out a deal. You two are going to be useful to me for once. Not bloody likely. The wise masters will hear how Asha Forrester kidnapped the venerable Bezak. How he wouldn't take less than 800 gold dragons, so he killed Bezak instead. Me? Luckily, we were there to deliver swift justice. So you steal the money, and we get the blame. Ponte osinas! Bojos me nomi jahosso kisikas! Alright, who dies first? Who wants to dance at the end of my sword? Kill them! Now! No one's more life. Here's one. Come on! She couldn't pass me! To be the one. You owe me one. 
It. Father Mogulis. What a joke. Come on. Fuck you. Are you serious? I like I pressed A before I even even Fuck you, Ash. <laughs> Oh, fourth time now? Okay. Wow. How many times will Ash return? Fuck you, Ash. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm pressing A. Okay. Try again. <laughs> Fuck you, Ash. <laughs> His age is not working. I guess that was going on. Like, okay. A is working just fine. I tested it. <laughs> Fuck you, Ash. <laughs> what the heck? I'm missing something. <laughs> Fuck you, Ash. <laughs> Okay, so when must you press this? Come on, I gotta press the button right. Fuck you, Ash. This is unbelievable. Fuck you, Ash. How about I don't press anything? Can I just not press anything? I'm just not gonna press anything. Because every time I press anything, I'm just gonna kill. Fuck you, Ash. There, I pressed it too freaking early. How the hell? Bazaar, I pressed it too early. Asha, Asha. Okay, good. That works out. Thank you. You know what this reminds me of? <laughs> that brothel in Norvos. You kill me. You. To Saul. Kill them both. Asha. Um. Asha. Oh, pressing button. Why in all the gods of fire and fuck? Who the fuck is he? My uncle. To Saul. Fuck. More on their way. 
We need to go. Should have killed that dude. Come on. Malcolm. Damn. We have to keep moving. Malcolm, stop. Asher, I'm glad I found you, my boy. It's been far too long. What are wow. you doing here? Your brother Ethan sent me. I'm here to bring you home. That's all bad news. Like, wow, how many times did I have to do that part? I was pressing the A too early. This makes no sense. Dodging too early. Like when you see somebody with a knife coming at you, you can dodge early. Like, you know, you move out of the reach of uh, his knife. Maybe that's, that's good. No! Not the case this time. Now. I have to cut some of that out. It was like 15 times. <laughs> then I figured, okay, I'm just not gonna press any buttons and see what happens. And then it worked. It's well done, this. It's uh, gonna be a classic Game of Thrones, obviously, where the, the people you think will be awesome and survive and the things will probably end up dead. Or that the story will twist in some way where they're, you know, no longer taking part. Uh, the Lost Lords, episode 2. Onward. This must what the heck? Is that Roderick and he's not dead? What's going on? Oh, Other people are getting eaten. Roderick or is dead. Not dead. Damn foresters. Have to be so fucking far away. That's his dad. Pressing Q. Father. That's far enough. I come from the twins bearing the dead of House Forrester. Lordly types from the looks of them. All right, we'll take them. Well, they're not free, are they? How much are you paying for them? Sir Ryland. You again. <laughs> Who have you got <laughs> this time? Some Sir poor Ryland. peasant dressed up like a lord. A stable boy was... in Bannerman's clothes. You oh, did this at Duskendale. <sighs> And you have the fucking stones to try it again. No, I... This house has suffered the loss of many good men. And you dare come here claiming to have forest the dead. They're for... Leave. <laughs> now. Fine. I'll dump them in the river then. <laughs> you come back here again, you won't be leaving. You got that? I, I heard you. Oh. That was a sheep fucker. <laughs> well, I'm sorry, sir. I don't worry, sir. What is it, sir? This one's still alive. You there? Who are you? It's me, Roderick. Roderick? Roderick? By oh, the gods, it is you, sir. Fetch the maester! Hurry! Fetch the maester! Roderick! Mm. Wow. 
wonder if it'll be okay to actually do things. That looks like a saw. We're just chopping him up. Okay, surgery. What is going on? Stop it! You're freaking me out. <gasps> My lord, you should not be awake. The milk of the puppy. Drink. Come now. That's it. Roderick! My lady! No. I am at a very delicate moment in the surgery. Please, I want to see my son. Let him. Sir, my lady, I must insist that you leave. No. Roderick, what have they done to you? These wounds would have killed any other man. As it is, he may never walk again. Roderick? What's wrong with him? He drank the milk of the poppy. Please don't leave me. Not yet. Gotta be knocked out for that surgery, though. That's... This is intense, you guys. Ah. Sister. <laughs> I haven't heard that one before. It's nice. Roderick, thank the gods. Brother, I thought oh, I lost oh. you. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. I'm fine. Don't worry. You don't look fine. How bad is it? <laughs> Maestor Tengren says your leg may never fully heal. Mm. And your face. I look half as bad as I feel. Well, at least you look better than you did. I guess. Roderick, there's something you need to know. Ethan is dead. Ethan? Bruce Bolton's bastard came here and threatened to take me away. Ethan grabbed me. And that monster put a blade through his throat. Like it was nothing. Ethan. How could this happen to him? We'll make Ramsay pay for what he did. I promise. Good. We're planning to honor Ethan in the grove alongside father. And now mother wants me to write this song for the funeral. I can't. Oh. <laughs> also just said. You can, Dahlia. I know you can. <laughs> it's been chaos here since he died. We have White Hill soldiers stationed in our courtyard. Even the small folk don't feel safe. You need to show everyone who this house belongs to. They need a lord. You're still a hero to them. If you lead, others will follow. I know you still need time to heal, but... I'll be fine, Talia. The council's meeting in the Great Hall right now, actually. Nobody expects you there, but if you think you're ready... I want to go. Dang. Can you even stand? They could use your leadership. Only one way to find out. I missed you, brother. You can do this, Roderick. 
I know you can. How about you help him? <sighs> Pressing Q. <sighs> oh dang, is it gonna be a, a walking lesson? Okay. Well, I'm really anxious to see what happens from here on out, but I do have to end this episode because I'm out of time. Personally, I have to get to work. So I will continue from here next time. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, don't forget to hit the like button, comment, and if you're not subscribed, and you can uh, make a decision if you want to subscribe or not, but please do subscribe if you feel like you like the content I have on my channel. I will see you guys soon enough. Bye.